What up, what up, what up, guys? Now, before checking out this video, I just wanted to let you know, man, if you're interested in being a full-time content creator, you may want to check the link down in the description. It's a free webinar, guys. Doesn't cost you anything to take a look, but I tell you what, it might just change your life, all right? Okay guys, so in today's video, man, we're gonna talk about one-to-one -one interaction, how it's replicated, how believable it is, and definitely still an area of concern or an area that could be improved in Madden. And we're gonna use some FIFA footage in this video, so definitely stick around so you can see that, showing you how it can be pulled off, you know, with EA Sports' own technologies. First thing to look at, look at number 67 here on the line, okay, the guard. This interaction here is just crazy. You know, it's almost like they don't have any awareness. <laughs> you know, he just gets caught up on Mac. And again, I mean, that's you can nitpick that a little bit, but I'm just saying, there's no real awareness of players, particularly when there's an interaction. Again, right here, look at uh, Lattimore and Julio Jones. They don't appear to even know that each other is right there. It's like they have no awareness of each other it doesn't play out in the animation and it's not believable and you're going to get a little body clip in here and again this happens in every every sports game guys this is not what i'm beefing about but i'm talking about how there's really no believable interaction if we look at fifa here look at how believable this is even though again not perfect but look at how believable this is now i'm controlling the guy in the white i don't know names guys i'm not a soccer head obviously i know that's neymar chasing me down but look at how I'm able to shield this guy away from the ball. And this is all happening contextually. This is contextual awareness. Look at how he's going to shield him away from the ball. And look at all of the jostling going on here. One-to-one -one interaction. Neymar trying to grab on. And my guy here is just, you know, keeping himself in relative position, shielding him away from the ball and able to get to the ball and look even turns <laughs> to his left you know switches up his direction to make sure he stays in front of neymar this is what i'm talking about these are the type of things we should be seeing in any one-to-one -one interaction in madden whether it's the trenches whether it's db and wider interactions etc etc and these are the things that i feel like are transferable between games ai and player interaction yes they're different sports but that should be a staple for all EA Sports games. You know, AI and player interaction should be transferable with all of their sports titles. You're clearly seeing it right here in FIFA 19. This is beautiful stuff. Is it perfect? No. You know, you see his foot go in the grass. You see a little bit of sliding. We're not talking about that, guys. It's video game stuff that all games suffer from. I'm not beating up any game or being overly critical to any game with stuff like that i'm just talking about the fundamental aspects and the replication that's believable this is very believable to me that interaction right there and we go back here to madden this is very stagnant like the animation at the end i like the fact that you know julio jones size matters <laughs> quote unquote but the way in which they replicated here is just not as believable not as appeasing to the eye as it was in FIFA 19. And this is all I'm saying. Little things like that take the game to the next level. They have to find a way to share all of these technologies, particularly things like AI and player interaction. All right, so that's all I got for this particular video. Let's put a bow on this one. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Don't forget hit that like button, and hit those notifications so you know when the next videos are coming. All right, guys, until next time, let me know what you think. Peace.